Can a classic AK survive being frozen, buried in rubble, soaked and packed with sand? Let's find out, but only the results, not the how-to. Today we test an AK under brutal conditions. Extreme cold, concrete dust, water immersion, and heavy sand exposure. This isn't a tutorial, just an engineering look at durability and design resilience. First, severe freezing. Left exposed to sub-zero conditions, the rifle and its ammunition were encased in ice, a dramatic visual. The takeaway? Low temperatures can immobilize mechanical systems, but robust designs often let weapons be recovered rather than replaced. Next, urban combat debris. Dust and small fragments can jam mechanisms and block moving parts. In the test, accumulated debris reduced reliability until cleared by technicians showing how battlefield environments stress even simple, rugged designs. Then, full water exposure. Immersion is a classic challenge lubricant washout, corrosion risk, and temporary malfunctions. After drying and inspection by professionals, many serviceable systems can be returned to operation, highlighting maintenance importance. Finally, sand the scourge of moving parts. Fine particles infiltrate every crevice. In the trial, repeated firing pushed much of the abrasive material out, demonstrating the AK family's tolerance for gritty environments, though long-term wear still remains a concern. The AK's simple, rugged architecture gives it remarkable battlefield tolerance. But durability isn't invincibility. Routine maintenance, inspection, and proper logistics are what keep weapons reliable across extreme conditions. Fascinated by military engineering? Which test surprised you most cold, concrete, water, or sand? Drop your pick in the comments and tell us why.